the sergeant that was with me said to me, anybody have radio experience? And I says, yes, I do. He says, well, get your butt down there and go back to the beach and get a radio. We got to stop this. The beach was just horrible. The smell, the stench was brutal. And I saw this kid with a radio on his back and I said, ha ha, there's my savior. There was an overhead burst took place. It hit him and it cut his arm off and it destroyed the damn radio. And I went down to him and a medic was with me and we tried to pull him up, but his arm had been severed completely and the kid died. And it's still right now, I see this kid. This was the first one I'd ever seen ever getting killed. Um, I don't know who he was from. I never knew what his name was or anything. But the medic and myself pulled him up. As we started to pull him up, another shell burst and I caught mine in my left leg. And the, the medic also got hit in his arm, but we still managed to pull him up to the berm and we hid under the berm. And that's where I spent the night in the berm, okay? And that was it. That was my D-Day.